Tap What's up, everybody? Time we time are the time Normies. Sir, it's Tap Nubby, Mickey, Marquetta. We're here to watch the South Park season 25 premiere. It's Ooh. Pajama Day. Pajama oh, Day. Pajama Day. I wish I was in my pajama. pajama. Memo, yeah, yeah, I know. Sure. We're out here in, in Los Angeles, by the way. This is Airbnb. This is not the usual studio. This is not a new studio. Um, we're all set up here. Do some collabs. Hopefully, you'll see them in the future. If not, check out our social media if you want to get an idea on what we're doing out here. Uh, we have all the social media handles down there. What do you guys think? We had a, we had a fun COVID pandemic special two-parter for mm-hmm. South Park last, and that was on Paramount+. Plus. So that's a special deal they did with Paramount Plus, mm-hmm. and now we're back to the regular season here on Comedy Central. Interesting. All right. Oh man, so Carmen's not gonna be Jewish? No. Oh, <laughs> unfortunately. I mean that 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 future path yeah, was closed think, anyway. Yeah. <laughs> but I mean, there's still more happening with that, right? With the Paramount Plus specials. Yeah, there's gonna yeah, be. There's I think like, they're contracted for like twelve. Twelve more at oh, least. Wow. Damn. How are they producing get, this much content? I don't know how they do it. Just, I'm not, yeah. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm I'm glad because they cut down. South Park used to be like fourteen episodes a season, and then they cut it down to eight, ten, and then eight. Yeah. So I guess they're just figuring out a different way to turn it out. What were you gonna say, Pat? So. Uh, no, I was just gonna say I think Trey Parker's like our age, right? Uh, mm-hmm. No, he's in his forties for sure. I think they're like older. 40s, I think. Hopefully. Yes. So he's gonna be around for a while. So we're gonna have South Park for a while. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. It's I already been around for a while. I remember my like people were watching this when I was in like fifth grade. Yeah, like, yeah. yeah. For it to have twenty five seasons, twenty five years on TV, they always say like we thought we were gonna cancel day one, and then season two. So, <laughs> like we're like trying to get canceled and push it too far, but they've literally reached the point where they're the only show I think out now that could push talk that. about anything or push the envelope, and people are like, well, that's just South Park. Yes, that's yeah, what they do. So. Yeah. Congrats. There was a bunch of orchestral versions of classic South Park songs to hype up this season. Go check those out. They were a lot of fun. Really? Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, Kyle falls a bitch. She's a big fat bitch. She's a big oh, What? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes, 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 yes. I we should react to those. Yeah. Oh, they're good. We, we could. We, we should honestly react yeah. to them. We should we watch it right up. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yes. So but yeah, is it a Flarket Plus? This is not a market substitute. Okay, we're watching it off southparkstudios.com. Actually, you can watch for free from there. Ooh. Really? That's where we're watching it commercial free yeah. too. Commer- commercial South free Park too. Park. What? Yes. So- Very easy to support the official release here, folks. Mm-hmm. Come on, let us start the show. Yeah. Okay, children, let's take our seats. Good morning, kids. So great to see you. <laughs> Hi, <laughs> he was Trump, just a no big deal. I met somebody. Oh boy. And, uh, oh boy. I'm pretty excited. <laughs> anyway, I really wanted you to meet him. What, you know, what the f- <laughs> yeah, Why? 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 <laughs> Teaching fourth graders. Right. Yeah. Come on, they sell you. I'm not gonna buy you. <laughs> what? This is really awkward. I, I told you I thought this was a bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, you're gonna come pick me up after school? Oh yeah, boy. Yeah, I'll be ready at like 3 30. School! They do! No, that. Fucking teach them something. <laughs> oh shit, it's Marcus! Should I have Oh my god! What? What? <laughs> if my teacher did this. She cornered that Rick. I'm saying that. Hey, Marcus, we've never heard of Rick, have we, kids? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? You don't listen and you blatantly go against my direction. Oh shit. What's going on here, students? I'm sick and tired. Students think they can walk all over their teachers. I'll tell you what else. This Friday, for pajama day at school, this class does not get to wear their pajamas. Oh. That sucks. Uh. <laughs> that would be so fun. I think we had it in elementary school. <laughs> oh, lead the troops, Carver. Do something good for once. <laughs> oh my god, that's so fucking funny. <laughs> He's he's the best addition on yes. this show. All right, send it in. Oh, oh. Mr. Principal, sir, can you please wear pajamas on pajama day? <laughs> it's my job 
to make decisions and stand by them to maintain order. You don't understand how important the jam day is to kids. What? Oh, no. what? It's like the Met Gala for children. <laughs> he sounds different. Now, he does, doesn't he? Sounds yeah. a little deeper. What? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> His team. That's I, I don't know so I, funny. I don't know if I ever had a pajama day. Bro, we had it. We did, yeah. yeah we yeah. never did. I we never did. did. It was like sweatpants or pajamas. <laughs> oh my god, look at that. Why are, there, <laughs> why are there photographers? <laughs> it is Met Gala for this. Yeah, it was a straight Met Gala. Oh, oh that's that. Uh, <laughs> I would have accepted it if there was an actual gala. Right? I would have too. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Is this Nazi Germany? Oh, my God. What is this? Oh, shit. I can just keep him home on pajama day? No, I can't stay home because you have to go to work because Pat David told you Fortune Favors the Brave. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's the have funniest you seen this commercial. It's so. Have you seen it? I have not. Oh have my not. god, it's so fucking funny. What? <laughs> 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 Shit does blow up like this though. Yeah, anything they don't agree with. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> they are super comfy. I mean, I don't know yeah. why we don't. Let's normalize this. <laughs> well, we should have worn pajamas for this reaction, right? Is, it, is this a metaphor for masks? Yeah, I think so. At least with how Mrs. Cartman was phrasing it. But I don't think it's entirely bad. I think they were just making a joke there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they don't really care. just want to wear pajamas, bro. This is an excuse. I mean, it was like, <laughs> like, what the fuck? God. How is that helping the kids? Yeah. Testburger! Miss Testburger, I need you to get me out of this. <laughs> I need you to get everyone in your class to work together and have Mr. Garrison come to me saying her pajama day should be reinstated. <laughs> this is your problem now, Testburger. <laughs> he just doesn't want the backlash. Yeah. <laughs> and they didn't do anything wrong. They just want to wear their pajamas. That pajama day song's gonna be stuck in my head. <laughs> what time is it? What time? Hey guys, wearing our pajamas shows that we care about those school kids. <laughs> <laughs> we care about other people. <laughs> What's going on, Mike? <laughs> well, what do you mean? You're not wearing pajamas. Uh, Mike, we're trying to do the right thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little bit of both. Well, Definitely COVID, but. No, no, you're right. <laughs> They're gonna kill you, bro. <laughs> yup. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> it should be like that. Yup. We need all of us, boys and girls, working together. Oh god! <laughs> and so together. We can shoot at the school. Oh, oh my god. god! Just done a lot. Anything a little bit? <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Carry up. We smear human shit on all the windows. Jesus. I was down for the human shit on the window. No, because then you're enabling his behavior. That is just the kind of manipulated psychotic thinking that we need. <laughs> <laughs> but they want pajama day back. They gotta do what they gotta do. <laughs> oh my god. This guy is cracking me up. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> 
This must be like fans telling them to get it. <laughs> Oh my god. This is totally ridiculous. I'm sorry, sir, but we aren't seeing anyone who isn't wearing their pajamas. Please, ma'am, sit down. The management prefers that everyone inside be nice and comfy, wumpy. Cozy, cozy. Comfy, wumpy to get a rooty, tooty, fresh, and fruity. If you prefer, you only need to wear your pajamas to get in. You don't have to wear them at your table while you're actively eating. Okay, we What's going on here, sir? <laughs> what? How does everybody just know German? That's because everyone talks about how when, oh, if you're making me wear yeah. a mask, this is like Nazi yeah, German. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Arguments become very hyperbolic. Yeah. Oh God. Perfect. He's in a manipulatable mood. What do you teach? <laughs> right. I think he's representing like misinformation. Yeah. And the way he held me when I got him. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Please oh, God. stop. Excuse me, Butters. Are you paying attention? No, oh, Butters. No. I'm sorry, Butters. Am I boring you? Oh no. Okay, well then maybe you can tell me what Rick uh, held me. No. Uh, does anyone know what I said when Rick held me tight? <laughs> this is really nice. This is security. <laughs> <laughs> None of you know the answer, do you? What's going on? Oh, no. Oh, God damn it. No. Just tell them. Just, 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 just start talking about what's this is happening. Stupid. I hate this. What the hell? Never seen so many arrests in one day. Oh, he was wearing a robe. That's not technically in pajamas. But she's wearing pajamas. Yeah, but she was caught shitting on the car of a guy who wasn't wearing pajamas. Ah. If you're not gonna let me go to bed, then I'm calling the police. He's just gonna go to bed wearing the clothes he wore all day. <laughs> Yo, Corey does not let me go to bed without like showering what? sometimes. They are wearing pajamas. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> yeah. I don't care what time of day it is. I don't ever wear pajamas. <laughs> right, a nice cozy condo after cozy, you cozy, 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 cozy. Fire's cracking. <laughs> I want some cocoa. You would beg me for pajamas, but if we had a condo, condo. No, <laughs> no, I wouldn't. All right, I'll be okay. <laughs> He's not getting in bed in his clothes. Okay, then you can just come sleep downtown at the station. Take her in, boys. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Why her? They're arresting people in pajamas? Oh my god. <laughs> Both sides use the argument. Arrest those people and all of those people. Oh no. Oh my god. Sorry about the buffering, y'all. Oh. <laughs> oh shit. Oh my god. I love this episode just because it's about something as simple as kids' okay. pajama day. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Is this it? Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> <laughs> He's out like a Kruger. Back to you, Tom. Oh my god. Both sides use the Nazi Germany thing a lot, actually. What the oh, fuck? What? <laughs> what the fuck, bro? Principle is something that you see as Truth. Tell them what's going on. Do something, we can run back home and put on our pajamas. Damn. I'll hand in my resignation. <laughs> no! <laughs> Saying you were wrong is sometimes the strongest thing you can do. You're totally wrong about that. <laughs> At least we still have opposite day to look forward to. <laughs> Test the murder! That's it! Today is not pajama day, it is in fact opposite day. <laughs> we had opposite days. You know? Yeah, <laughs> 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 
no matter what he's saying, you can't yeah, make me do that. You can't make me do this. That was oh pretty God, funny. That was, that was good. hilarious. <laughs> Man. Oh, that was good. That was good. Oh, I'm going to have a pajama day. Can we have that? Don't we, we do this? We should, yeah, for like, sure, yeah. Third Friday for Mark is a pajama day. What do you guys feel? Is it comfy wumfy or cozy wozy? Cozy wozy. Cozy wozy. Oh, cozy wozy. Comfy wumpy. Comfy wumpy is funny too. Comfy wumpy doesn't have the uh, same. That was a uh, that was frustrating to watch because they weren't weren't telling the principal what's actually happening. But that's yeah. I, but I think that's the point. Like yeah. it, if we look at it in real politics, like the actual issue is never well, never the yeah. You know, like the the truth of what happened or didn't happen doesn't it matter. Just, it, like once it becomes politicized, it's yeah. just like a us versus them thing. And it's also about like the reactionary nature of like everyone these days it's just like you need to as soon as you know a tiny bit of information you just want to get it out there as soon as possible without fact checking without like checking the context for mm -hmm. what happened mm -hmm. and so you just like want to get like this empty information out there and as soon as you do it it will get a life of its own yep. and I then you have made a decision like made an opinion so somebody yeah. give you another one like no i yeah. stand with it it's like you guys saw the headline <laughs> yeah this i, 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 I feel, I feel like uh, to, to add on to uh, like like people want to get information out there quickly i feel like it's almost like a dopamine hit for people because like people people want to feel like oh i know this thing yep. that that mm -hmm. other people don't and now that i put it out there like i'm the person that like Put this out. You know, put like brought it to my friends or whatever, my guess, circle or whatever. Yeah, for gossips, but like for news outlets, it's even that. I feel like I feel like people like in the workplace, they're like, "Hey, did you hear about this?" Like, it, it, you know, it's like a, and then it's, it's hard for people to walk back those statements too, or like like at the end realize that they might have made a wrong or reactionary decision, mm -hmm. and they don't want the bad PR also of just yeah. being like, "Hey." We, we didn't mean to fire this person for this reason or, you know, whatever random bullshit news yeah. comes out every day of like someone taking a really extreme action towards mm -hmm. someone. Like, some of them I can get behind, like, you know, if someone's caught to be just a vile racist or homophobe or something and then they get fired from their job for looking like a moron yeah. in public, then I'm, I'm, I'm fine with that. Like, you, yep. you, you fucked up and if it doesn't align with company values, they have the right to do that. But also some people have done something like that before they knew the full story, like you're saying. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Too chicken shit to walk it back. Yeah. So one thing I really liked about this episode, it's like anytime anybody's against anyone, they just think automatically it's Nazi <laughs> Germany. Do like, you yeah. guys not understand what that was? Like, yeah. Just because somebody's telling you something doesn't mean it's yeah. Nazi Germany. Dude, like, that, that's not what we live. <laughs> it's crazy. I can't believe. Every like, time. I, I see that like on Twitter every day. Somebody's just like, having a meltdown over mask mandates yeah it is just like are you fucking kidding me <laughs> do yeah. you do you actually know history do you know what actually happened in China? and that's why well, yeah, yeah dare you yeah we like we repressed like oh we are like jews and that's the was like do you understand what happened stupid like, do you understand holocaust wearing masks is not the same i hate seeing those they, they talked about it too with like having your vaccination yep. card yeah as well and it's like you literally i can't dictate what i do and i'm like well we all have to get regular shots we all have to get driver's licenses we all get passports we we, we've done vaccine. government mandated things before yeah, yeah. and then yeah it's it's a choice and consequence like if the, if the majority of a society has decided that we're going to do things a certain way and you decide not to follow that that's fine that's your life but you also have to suffer the consequences of what that means like if you're, if you're not going to participate in society then don't bitch about it when it inconveniences you Be, being south park how they always kind of play on both sides i do see one side pulling the nazi germany card a little more than the other um you know the people who are told yeah. to wear masks they, they say that but then you also see like people calling like conservatives and everyone on the yeah. other side yeah. like you all not see German. Yeah. yeah so yeah. like both sides shouldn't be using such a no. terrible fucking thing that happened and, and, and nobody should be using, it. yeah <laughs> nobody should be using that like guys yeah, yeah, yeah. please learn your history like that nothing has been happening in america close to being nazi germany yeah like yeah. any i mean I I guess yeah. there's, there's what, some. What would you consider? You said nothing happened in America, like uh, in the history. In Japan, no, 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 yeah. no, right now, like right now, right like now, right now, okay. like yeah, right now, nobody's like so okay, so I was just confused about that. <laughs> no, I mean, no, right now, we, like we're not putting people in a van and taking them to yeah. concentration yeah. camps. Like you just being asked to wear masks. Well, I wonder yeah, if they're no, teaching that. We've done that before. Yeah, there's a whole, like, ice, oh, we have done that whole, before. Like, yeah, I'm saying situation. right now, what's happening, like with the vaccine and mass immigration. Oh yeah, I mean, we are. Yeah, same as. No, it's not the same. 
same. I, I yeah. do love that overall the episode was about something as simple as pajama day. Yeah. I know the yeah. mask comparison was there. It, they, they did a few mask comparison jokes, but also it was just about the pajamas, I think, to the kids. Well, the kids no, was I, no, the I actually think it was about Garrison because, like, the, like it, whatever the issue is, it becomes so contentious and people do get, like, very, like, intense. And, like, they have us fighting each other. Meanwhile, the person who sparked it, like... <laughs> He represented he represented misinformation like whatever the fuck yeah. he was talking about was like some arbitrary shit that didn't matter but like it gets politicized yeah. like, and that's the thing I feel like he represented like politicians that are just like out of touch with society that they just like get on the mic and say whatever the fuck and they have yeah. no idea what the consequences of that are and it, yeah. and it becomes like a thing in society but that we I didn't even care yeah, yeah. Well, well, you know to... what I think is the most fucked up about this episode that like there was not like an an ending that would be satisfactory to this because he basically the principal just found a loophole so yep. he doesn't have to acknowledge that he was yeah. wrong yeah. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. like that is also like this like people when when like they do something wrong or not not people in general but just like leaders um just when they do something wrong they will never acknowledge and just find an excuse yeah and i fucking hate that like if you're true trying to apologize and acknowledge that you've done something wrong then just do it it's very simple you don't have to explain the circumstance, like, I mean, you can if you want, but don't use, don't explain it in a way that it sounds like it wasn't really my fault. I'm yeah. Like, I'm yeah. sorry. It is a funny loop. Sorry. Lo- <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's a funny loophole, though, to use opposite day because then it makes, no matter what, if you're wearing pajamas at school or not wearing it, it made it okay because yeah. you don't have to participate in opposite day. Mm-hmm. So, and, and then it's funny that it just carried over to the police department and shit. Like, why are they celebrating opposite so day funny. everywhere? But, and then the very end, so no matter what, that. even if there was this magical opposite day loophole that would make everyone agree, you'd still have the guy at the end be like, you can't tell me to cut my dick and piss. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can't tell me to do anything. Like, literally, we can't please everybody. You can't please everybody. Yeah, I was like, so. all right, cool. So like, we don't care what you wear as long as it covers your dick and piss. Like, yeah, some people just want to live their life like that. And I mean, it... It, it makes uh, there's there's places where they can do that but yeah usually people that are like that intense about it like they're living in a section of society where they don't they're probably not making a lot of money don't have a lot of opportunities they're just pissed off at the world so like I understand the anger but it's often like directly misplaced. yeah very misplaced mm-hmm. no I yeah South Park is great it just takes topics and it just makes it like so simple Pajama yeah. day. It's like, it's like, it was okay. all about pajama day. And it yeah. felt like an old classic episode. They weren't necessarily satirizing anything in the current events, except for the yeah. Matt Damon yeah. Bitcoin commercial. Which I, I got to see, guys see that. You guys haven't old. seen that? It's, it's, it's not even for. Uh, it's, uh, I'll, I'll show it to you guys. This but is yeah, great. What is it? Dare fortune, fortune favors the brave. <laughs> he's like he's like walking down this hallway. There's like a space shuttle like launching in the background. I There's saw like, it. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god! Hold that up so we can watch that. Oh my god! And then them saying like, "All right, we've overused the joke." I can't that, believe that's something you... like South Park has been criticized in the past of like overdoing a joke. So that was yeah. also they were overdoing yeah. it by telling themselves they're overdoing yeah. it and they continue doing it. <laughs> I wish they would have translated the parts with the reporter when he's speaking German. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was hilarious. I don't know why I thought that was... He just kept escalating it further and further. Did you understand any of that? I I caught like a word here. So it was actual German? He wasn't just like waking yeah, words? Yeah, I mean, I don't I don't know if like the sentence as, as a whole made sense, but I could like hear <laughs> words that I knew what they are. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. That was hilarious. In the end, he came with his old, like a whole new book. like... What is happening? So silly, yeah. <laughs> Just yeah. pajama day. It, it was like Magala. So you guys had pajama days at high school? Mm-hmm. Not high school. school. Not elementary, elementary school. school. Elementary school. Yeah. yeah. Pajama day, had, opposite day. We had opposite day. Pajama we had day. opposite day. Really? So how did opposite day go? Because like then everybody had to be so. <laughs> you don't have homework today. But you yeah. Do have homework today. No! <laughs> it was. I guess. Maybe it was an unofficial thing we did in school. That was, that was unofficial. Day. It wasn't like the school. Yeah, yeah. Thing. No, but they def- the school definitely did do pajama, pajama day. day. Pajama they also, they also day where you just wore like your team. Yeah, sports team, like college sports yeah. or just regular oh, basketball, football out. team. Wow, well, yeah. that would start numerous conflicts. Oh, it did. It did. <laughs> it did. I, I don't have a best friend because of it. An elementary. <laughs> Not just. <Dude. laughs> what? One time in Prague, my cousin was wearing. There are two soccer teams that are like very popular, but they hate each other. And my of cousin course. was wearing like the jersey of one team. And then we were in the in the subway, and there were there were like these like 
thugs in like the other jerseys colors and he literally <laughs> my cousin saw saw them before we entered the train took his shirt off and was on the train shirtless oh my <laughs> god <laughs> That's how serious it is. <laughs> no. I, I'm not trying to get beat up today. Yeah. Hold on. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh so funny. People, people get so offended on that one. Yeah. But I love it. We should do that. We should do have, have a day at Normie's. Pajama day. Pajama day. I'm just going to have it. I mean, I mean right, everybody's been living in their PJs, right? Like, you're working remote now. I yeah, work yeah, with my PJs. Yeah. I'll just change my top right. and I'm like still wearing my robe. And then I'm like, just put it like, okay, that's fine. Yeah, I'm not too jazzed about pajama day. <laughs> I, yeah, love it. I love it. Cozy Wozy with a hot cup of cocoa. Yeah. Long, long John's Day. Ladies and gentlemen, let us know what you thought. Long John's Day? <laughs> <laughs> long John's Day. Oh, God. <laughs> let us know what you thought of this episode and be back next week for more South Park. We'll try to watch it a little earlier in advance. Yes. Bye bye.